Hi, I'm Gary White. And I'm Yvonne McNary. We're here at the Marion County Fairgrounds for the Marion County Fair 2016, and we're here for the harness racing, Yvonne. Yes, indeed. My event, Gary. Love the, love the harness racing. Exactly. Lots of fun. You can hear behind us uh, Troy Lancaster, who's been emceeing these races for a while, right? Yeah, for quite a few years. I'm not going to exactly. say how many. <laughs> yeah, a long time. And we're getting ready for the race number one here for the harness racing. And that is sponsored by Citizens National Bank. It's a two-year-old Colt Trot Kentucky Fair Stakes. And who are our horses in this first race? Our number one is Spectre of a Gun. Number two is Father Julio. Number three is Sierra Grande. And number four is Hidden Creek. Okay, so we have four horses. It's a one-mile trot with a purse of 4000 Four thousand dollars! Wow. Exactly. If only I could win the four thousand. Exactly. If we could get that, that'd be very nice. Huh? Yes, it would be. That's a lot of ice cream, huh? That's exactly right. That's exactly right. So, every year we get to choose which horse we th would like to think is going to try and get to win, right? Cheer on, I guess. And who are you going to pick? I'm going to cheer on number two, Father Julio. Father Julio. In the last four starts. He's earned 320 bucks, but you know tonight could be that big night. It could win that 4,000. Exactly. You know, exactly. you just never know. It's a horse race. Literally. Literally. <laughs> and also Tyler Sheehan, who has some Lebanon connections, is the jockey on that horse. Yes, he is, and he also, you know, Hop Hopkinsville down in Western Kentucky, my mm -hmm. old stomping ground. So uh, you have lots of connections. Yes, I do. If only they were winning connections. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to pick number four. The Hidden Creek, written by Rodney DeBeck. Okay, that sounds good. And the uh, last four starts, uh, big goose egg there, Gary. Well, he's just waiting for tonight to come shoot now the gate. Come back, that four, right. that four thousand dollars. Exactly. So the horses are on the track, getting ready for this. We're going to be able to see the race in just a couple minutes. And our coverage of harness racing here at the Marion County Fairgrounds for Marion County Fair 2016 is being brought to you by Citizens National Bank, who also is sponsoring this particular race. Yes, indeed. Doesn't get much better than that, does it? No. Speaking of not getting much better than this, this weather is amazing. Oh, it is amazing, Gary. Before I... We perspired quite a bit <laughs> at the races and you know all for a good cause because we love the harness racing but tonight it's just very pleasant yes and when the sun goes down it's going to get even better absolutely so stay tuned here on central kentucky television for harness racing from the marion county fair two-year-old trotting colts lined up kick off tonight's six race car this one's sponsored by citizens national bank field of four Ron Gay. Horses up the back stretch, it's Father Julio, who has an eight-link lead. Sierra Grand, first-time starters in second. She is six clear of her stable mate, Hidden Creek. And it's far back to Specter of her gun. As they trot out of the far turn, Father Julio at his second career start. He's maintaining a large advantage from Sierra Grand. Begins to tighten up slightly in second. It's still 10 further back to his stable mate, Hidden Creek. And even further back to Specter of a gun as they trot through the stretch. It's all Father Julio. Father Julio 
A homebred going to score here for the first time in his career. Father Julio wins it easily. Sierra Grant finishes in second. His stable made hit and three for third. Spectre Verdun will finish fourth. Well, Yvonne, you did pretty well that time. Yeah, looks like I may have won that race, Gary. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Easily. Easily. Congratulations to Father Julio. Well, thank you so much, Gary. You know, I put a lot of time and energy into training Father Julio. You exactly. know, <laughs> I'm taking all the credit for it, you know. <laughs> exactly. At least I showed. Yeah, you did. You did. And you, and you showed well. Yeah. You showed well. You didn't win, but you showed That's well. That's right. Yeah. I showed. You showed well. You showed very well. So, Father Julio came in first there, and that was by Tyler Sheehan. And second place was Sierra Grand. Mm -hmm. Third, Hidden Creek. And then Spectre of a Gun just barely came in there. I, Spectre of a Gun is still on the track. <laughs> He's working his way around. <laughs> he just, he, I don't know what happened. That's it, you know, it's such it's, it looked good on paper. <laughs> yes, if you just looked at what they've done in the past, you wouldn't really maybe have expected what we just saw, right? Exactly. Yeah, and and us being you know just doing this once and twice a year. I mean, gee, we we have to go by what everybody else says, so we exactly. usually follow that. But anyway, I won. Yes, exactly. Congratulations. <laughs> well, thank you, Gary. I'm trying you to. You get to pick the first scoop of ice cream. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, modest. I can tell. I have to gloat while I can because. I <laughs> you know, because another race is coming up, and you never know. Right. Right? Yes, I have to gloat while I can. Yes. Exactly. Yes, indeed. Speaking of the next race, the next race is going to be by sponsored by the May Empowerment Agency, another company you see here on Central Kentucky Television. It's another one mile trot, purse of four thousand dollars, and. Who are in this? Who are the horses in this race? Okay, number one is Odetta Hall, Tyler Sheehan. Uh, number two, Shawnee Beauty, uh, Henry Lunsford. Number three, Sha uh, Shawnee Spirit, Henry Lunsford. Well, must be twins. Actually, uh, yes, uh, I think they're the owners uh -huh. there, and then the trainers are over on the other side. Uh huh. And then uh, number four is Madam Secretary. Number five, Auntie J. Number six, Shay's Victory, and number seven, Win It All. Okay. What are you going to go for, Gary? I'll give you first choice since you showed last. Well, actually, uh, Madam Secretary is was trained by James Averett Sr., Jimmy, uh, James Averett Sr. here in Lebanon, in Marion County. And I used to watch that TV show, so I think I'm going to go with Madam Secretary. Madam Secretary, okay, for Gary. Well. It may I be a winning year for uh, former Madam Secretary, so you never know. You never know. So, you know it's a horse race. Okay, I'm going to go for Odetta Hall, number one. Okay. First horse race. And why? Uh, Tyler Sheehan. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he's becoming my favorite. There you go. I can depend on him. Okay, let's do one no. more. Now, since there are seven in this race, it's not as bad to pick two each, right? Right. In the last one, we would have picked all the horses, or we picked two each, because there are only four horses. So with seven, next I'll go with Win It All. I was going to go with that one, but that's okay. That's okay. Uh, I'm going to go with Auntie J. Auntie J. A long okay. shot. Yes. A long shot. Maybe I'll win two ice creams off this one. Right. You'll get a double scoop. A double scoop? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Again, this is the Harness Racing at the Marion County Fairgrounds. Brought to you on Channel 6 Television by Citizens National Bank. And this race is sponsored by the May Empowerment Agency. And we'll see if Yvonne can maintain her winning streak. I certainly hope so, so I can gloat some more. It felt so good not to be a loser. <laughs> You're never a loser. I know, yeah, yeah. <laughs>